Okay, hello, my name is Captain Łukasz Piątek, 32nd Tactical Air Base WASC. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm <coughs> my post there is Chief of uh, Standardization and Evaluation Section. Uh, our main reason for us to be here is to perform exercise with Lithuanian and French Air Force that is stationing on a QRA in Baltic States. This is for the fifth time the Baltic Region training event takes place and our squadron participates for the third time uh, in the past three years. Our, our um, task for this sortie was to perform uh, QRA on uh, Polish M28 with uh, no, no communication. So we scrambled, we intercepted this aircraft and uh, provided support for it until it entered the uh, Estonian airspace. From that point on, it was intercepted by uh, Lithuanian L-39ers and after that French Mirage 2000. It was very easy. The ATC controllers and uh, towers, they granted us uh, enormous uh, help and they were very eager to see us here. They ever requested to fly by, so we did that. I uh, hope they're happy with that. I'm Brigadier General Valery Sar. I'm commander of Estonian Air Force. And today we hosting in Estonia in Tallinn International Airport, the Baltic Regional Training Event number five. This is an event which started uh, two years ago in 2008 with uh, Baltic Regional Training Event and the task of this event was to train Baltic uh, teams, Baltic Command Control System in air policing issues. Um, it's extremely nice experience for uh, three Baltic uh, countries to train all fighter controllers uh, and uh, mission control officers uh, to operate with NATO airplanes. Now more than seven countries already participated in Baltic regional training events and today we have uh, the fifth exercise. The scenario of this exercise is very easy. The airplane losing communication uh, cannot orient in airspace. The Polish Air Force F-16 uh, taking off to help them uh, and they following this airplane and uh, helping this airplane to land at Tallinn International Airport. In parallel, they made two, three exercises in our training area. All this exercise was uh, a lead from our Baltic Regional Air Sovereignty Coordination Center or CRC uh, Karmelava and um, all radars, all communication equipment in the Baltic region were involved in this training process. Yes, so I am uh, Lieutenant Colonel Sebastian Vallet from the uh uh, Curie Detachment of Cholet, I'm the detachment commander there. And uh, today's event was uh, a training, in fact, for the Curie of Cholet and some other aircraft from uh, NATO uh, to enhance the procedures and enhance tra training and interoperability of uh, all the nations. For the training, an aircraft who lost the communication with the uh, control agency, and uh, we uh, just uh, relay the uh, the uh, interception uh, after the F-16 uh, to uh, continue on uh, the escort till uh, Tallinn. Uh, for m my uh, person, I am. It's the first time here uh, in uh, the Baltic states, and uh, the first time I'm land yeah. landing here, yeah. uh, obviously. But uh, for France, in fact, the second time they are doing the uh, QRA round in the uh, Cholet uh, Air Force Base in Lithuania. Yes, we are well prepared for this because it's something that's happening as well yeah. in our country, obviously. Uh, but uh, it's all the time very interesting to, to do that kind of training with different nations.